What's up all you Carcamaniacs out there? This is Carcamo, the Forger of Pain! And I'm at the Nintendo floor. Actually, it's the Legend of Zelda floor because that's what Nintendo is doing. They're pushing up Zelda and for me, it was about time. As you can see in the background, there's Zelda. No, I'm kidding, of course that's not Zelda. Get the name right for once, that's Link. In case you didn't know, then you should know by now. But, as always, I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna jump in right away. We got to play The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Why the wild? Because literally, Link is in the forest, he's in the woods. And as you can see, maybe my only complaint is maybe there's too much grass. And uh, yeah, thumbs up if you got that. And if no, it's still, don't give me a thumbs down. The thing is that, well, this floor is amazing. It's Zelda theme. You can see like the statues of the, there's the trees and there's everything. I feel like I'm in the game. And well, I appreciate for that Nintendo. Now, uh, I did a line like for two freaking hours and I got in also. The amiibos were on the way and you know, I'm an amiibo lover. And then we got to see a trailer, and it was pretty exciting. We got into the corridor like we were inside of a dungeon. Then the doors opened, and we got to this beautiful paradise. And I got to play the game, of course, firsthand. And um, I got to say, the story, Link wakes up. Remember, Link is the hero of time. So he's summoned here. Obviously, we don't know why, but I'm going to take a wild guess that it's gonna be to save Zelda for the one million time. And I have no problem with saving a princess. So, so that's probably the story. They haven't said that. The thing is that, well, you wake up and Link is in, in his undies. And I kid you not, he's in his undies. Then you get some clothes and then you go and you explore. That's the thing about this game, the exploring. It's open world. You're out there, and uh, Zelda is an adventure RPG uh, game. But now there's even more RPG elements. Like Link can equip different armor, different uh, clothes, gear, and you can see like everything physically changing. Uh, also, Link, when he's like in a cold environment, he's like, oh, oh my God, it's cold here. And you can actually see that, and it affects, uh, I'm not sure if it affects like uh, the hearts, like the energy, the health, but it does affect him. Also, Link has a stamina bar. Not a, not a bar, like a stamina circle. It reminds me of Shadow of the Colossus, when you're climbing and stuff, then the stamina, the stamina circle depletes, and you have to be careful. He also swims, the water effects look amazing, and he can also, yeah, he can also drown. So, you know, be on the watch for the stamina circle. When you're in the wild, no pun intended, you'll see like, um, you'll see the enemies. And there's a lot of things to do. Like when I first started playing, I was lost. Like, oh my God, where do I go? And uh, at the beginning, yeah, it's one of those games like, where the fuck do I go kind of game. And that's not a bad thing, that's a good thing. Uh, hi, DDP. So, uh, you go in the wild, like I said, no pun intended, and you see the enemies, and they're on their thing, they have their own, like, uh, camps and fires, and you can, you know, kick their asses and take their weapons. Also, Link doesn't only have, like, the hook shot or the master sword, you can use, like, a club, like a branch of a tree, like an axe, and yeah, it's pretty exciting. Um, what else, what else? I'm trying to do this by memory because I was playing and I couldn't take note. Also, the weapons have like, they, they are damaged. So at the beginning I thought I was slashing and hacking away and then I saw like, oh my God, my, your weapon just got, you know, screwed up, all damaged. And so yes, you have to be careful for that. But also Link can hunt with his bow and arrow. I was hunting like, uh, what was it? I don't know, but Link, he's unstoppable. He's killing animals, he's eating fruits, he's eating meat. Yeah, he's not a vegan. And uh, I don't know what else to say. I'm just gonna post some gameplay for you guys. But the game's amazing, I'm hooked. 
I'm waiting for this Legend of Zelda game. Uh, I'm not sure if it will always be for. I'm not sure if the game will only be available for the Nintendo NX or the Nintendo Wii U. Uh, I have to ask. And if they mention that, I might have missed it. So again, I'm sorry. I'm only human, okay? Anyway, guys, this is Karkumo, the Forger of Pain from Los Angeles, California, E3 2016, from the Legend of Zelda floor, saying, like or die.